Hello, 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 guys out there. How are you today? So basically, we're going to continue with the different uh, classes related to food. So today's class, we're going to learn how to create your lunch menu. That's why you're seeing, okay, the topic right now on the screen, lunch menu. So let's get started. To create the lunch menu, okay, we need some vocabulary, some food vocabulary, the one that you are seeing right now, right here on the screen. So first of all, what we're going to do, we're going to go through pronunciation. At this moment, I remember I put this vocabulary before in some of the videos, and we went through the translation in Spanish, I remember, in different examples. So today we're going to go right straight, okay, through this, and I'll explain why I have the vocabulary in different colors. So let's get it started. Pronunciation one more time. Number one, smoked salmon, stuffed turkey, bread cheese gnocchis, bread spicy chicken wings, grilled veal cutlets, fried flounder, spicy cheesy bacon burger, cheese sticks, sirloin steak with mushrooms, fried spicy avocado tacos, spicy nacho soup with cream, creamy spicy tamales, fillet of fish with a touch of spicy soy sauce, baby crunchy rib with spicy soy sauce, spicy tortilla soup, grilled rib with twisted fries, beef soup, and also chicken and spicy nuggets. All right. So basically, this vocabulary is going to help us to create the lunch menu. So here we have the vocabulary, okay, of different food that we're gonna use later. I'm gonna explain, okay, what I have it, okay, in different colors right here later. So the next activity or a slide that we're gonna watch is basically about different desserts. So this list is gonna help us, okay, to create also our lunch menu. You will see how, it gonna, how it's gonna go. So let's go through pronunciation one more time. We have cake, chocolate, pie, popsicles, brownie, croissant, pop cake, cupcake, cookie, pudding, lollipop, ice cake, candy, donut, three milk cake, and also ice cream. So basically, this is the vocabulary, the serve vocabulary that we have to create our lunch menu. One more time. Cake, chocolate, pie, popsicle, brownie, croissant, pop cake, cupcake, cookie, pudding, lollipop, ice cake, candy, donut, three milk cake, and also ice cream. So guys, so let's continue. All right, remember, we have this vocabulary right here. We have this other one right here about the search. And now here we have the main slide to create the lunch menu, which is this one. So here we have, okay, the vocabulary pronunciation that we just did. And also here we have the other one right here. So but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do right now is this, okay? I'm gonna, okay, go out of here. I'm gonna, okay, put uh, the other one that we have right here. I'm gonna put it here with the color. All right, this one is the one that we really need. Okay, just give me a second so I can do something right here. Okay, okay guys. So here we have this slide, okay, with the vocabulary, okay, that we were using with different colors. So how are we gonna do this to create the lunch menu? It says, these are the indications. Create your lunch menu, work individually. Use the food vocabulary, which is this one right here, to create your lunch menu. So how are you gonna do it? Basically like this. So you're gonna write three starters, two main dishes, two soups, six whole drinks, three hot drinks, and also three desserts. Okay, once you finish, okay, we're gonna share this information, okay, with the different classmates, okay, or even to yourself. So the vocabulary one more time. Number one is smoked salmon, stuffed turkey, breaded cheese gnocchis, breaded spicy chicken wings, grilled veal cutlets, fried flounders, spicy cheesy bacon burger, cheese sticks, silent steak with mushrooms, fried spicy avocado tacos, spicy nacho soup with cream, creamy spicy tamales, fillet of fish with a touch of spicy soy sauce, baby crunchy rib with spicy soy sauce, spicy tortilla soup, real rib with twisted fries, beef soup, chicken spicy nuggets. So if you see, okay, we have different colors. The blue color basically, basically correspond to the main dishes, okay? 
the blue color correspond, okay, to write information for the main dishes. The red color correspond to write the information for the starters, okay, or entries, all right? The blue color is to write the information for the starters or entries. So the green color is, okay, for the information that we're gonna write into the soups, okay, category. So that's what we're gonna do. Check it out. So with all this information that you can see right here on this screen, so you're gonna create your lunch menu. How are you gonna do it? By following this format, check it out, boom. So here we have, okay, the format that you're gonna be like creating your lunch menu. Number one, instructions, creating your lunch menu. So here you're gonna write three different entries or the starters. So remember the starters are the ones that are in, okay, red color. Main dishes, the main dishes, okay, you're gonna write three. And the main dishes are the ones in blue color, okay? So you select any of those, okay, that are in blue color and you write them right here. Desserts, desserts, okay, you're gonna write four. So there you have the picture, okay, which is this one right here. Here we have, okay, a list of desserts. So you select four and you put it right here. And then, okay, the three different soups that we have right there. And also here, okay, we don't have the drinks. So you need to check it out, what possible drinks you might be writing right here for cold drinks. Then we have the other category, which is hot drinks, you need to write four. And finally, others, okay, and others, okay, we can put maybe, uh, pies, we can put sandwiches, okay? And any other, okay, that you like to, uh, like that you like to put, okay, for your lunch menu. So guys, so basically this is the way that you can create your lunch menu using this format, also using this information right here about different food vocabulary and also the search. So guys, so basically this is the way that we finish, okay, today's class, remember, create, Okay, your lunch menu, and after you create your lunch menu, okay, uh, try to create a conversation offering that lunch menu. In fact, I'm gonna give you, okay, another video in which, okay, you can practice uh, making a conversation, uh, I mean, making a reservation and also offering the lunch menu. That's gonna be on the next video. So if you have comments, okay, write them below, okay, click, uh, uh, give me a like, and learn English with me. Very easy, very simple, okay? See you later. Bye-bye, catch you later.